I could be mean, I could be angry, no, I could be just like, oh my god, you, sir, wait, no, 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 you're fine, you're fine, don't worry, I know rescue breaths, oh, just a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, Mmm. Wow, you're so cute. Look at your eyes. Oh, they're open. Oh, they're blinking. Oh, you're awake. Oh, wait, hold on. Two rescue breaths. Mwah. Okay, and one, two, God, your chest feels so great. Yeah. Nope, this is, wait, what's the song they said that we should do when doing rescue air pumpity things? Chest compressions, that's what it is. It's, isn't it just, don't stop, make it drop. That's a wop. But there we go. Yeah. The, oh, oh, the, the, more rescue breaths. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. What, what? No, sir, I'm rescuing you. You, you need rescue breaths. And clearly, God, you're so cute. Your lips are delicious. Mm -hmm. Not chapped at all. So cute. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All. Mwah. <laughs> Oh my god, you're so, and your face is just so perfect. What? Sir, no, no, no. You don't need to freak out. You don't need to get upset. Sir, you don't need to be upset at all. I'm rescuing you. Yeah, that's what tiger girls do. We see people get in the river, and then we go, and we rescue. Sometimes we eat them, but you I want to rescue. So, mm -hmm. what? Oh, ooh. Yeah, you're right. My claws could dig into you, but they haven't yet. Don't worry. I'll be more careful. One, two, three, four. Your tummy looks cute. I just want to tickle it just a... Oh, sorry. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. What do you mean I could crack your rib? Sir, you need to calm down. I'm rescue. Oh, that does make sense. I guess if you are talking to me, then you're not drowning. And you don't need rescue breaths. Probably not chest compressions. Is your heart beating faster? Your heart, well, my mind's beating really fast because you're so cute. I mean, well, I mean, because I had to rescue you because you were near the river. Did you fall it? You didn't get wet. Well, well, I asked because I'm super wet. Oh, because I was, I jumped over the river. I didn't get in it, but I'm super wet. Anywho, no, I, I just, I saw you walking up there and I smelled you and you this smell delicious. And, and then I like was in the bushes and I was like, I was not stalking you. I was following you down the river path. And then I saw you fall. You crouched? Well, it looked like you fell down. So I figured I'd come over and I'd do the thing that us tiger girls do. We rescue people. Yeah, just give them kisses. And oh, well, I guess it. I mean, I breathed on you with my nose like a like that when you go to kiss you go it's oh that could get like snot on people i'm not i don't have allergies today so there's no snot anyways so like i went to go give you rescue breath well i guess they were just more kisses but do you know how cute your lips are i know i was sitting there thinking when i was over there in that bush wow i bet he'd be a really good kisser he's got that delicious little bottom lip that you just want to get a hold of and go <laughs> Oh, sorry. Oh, me? <laughs> My name is Zena. What's your name? Oh. <laughs> no, I just, I like the sound of that. Really, I like everything about you. You smell great. What? No, 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 no. Like, not in a creepy way, but in a, I kind of just want to, like, you know, sniff your, you want to see have you go work out and get all sweaty and delicious and then you'll smell all masculine and tasty and I just want to then give you a tongue bath with a what what like pheromones it's a it's a thing it just makes you want to right on someone no make you go a little feral what no I don't know do you have a girlfriend oh that was so forward I'm so sorry no 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 you're right you're right you're right you're right but do you Oh, good. Okay. Um, no, I, I don't I don't have anyone either. I just, um, what are you doing tonight? What? Oh, um, you were just walking down here alone? Um, well, would you, do you want to get back to that? You know, being alone? I don't like being alone. I feel like I'm alone a lot. What? Well, tigers, yeah, we're like, 
solitary creatures. In fact, <laughs> maybe. Yeah, we're, we're solitary, but like we do have families and stuff and there's always like critters running around and but they don't really get to know you. You have all these people around you and and animals and stuff, but none of them really get to know the inner you. And then, like, you're nice to them and everything, but then you don't want to let everybody in. And you've got a problem with that. So you just tell jokes and deflect so that maybe they think you're really funny, but then they really don't get to know you. And then you, it makes it where you can feel super alone even when you're in a really crowded room. I just got really depressing for no damn reason. What are you doing tonight? <laughs> let me tell you what you could be doing. You know, we could um go back to my cave. You know, we can cave tiger girl and chill as in you could cave in my walls with your huh oh um no your place is cool too you have wi-fi yeah we could go watch tiger queen it's like tiger king but it's with carol baskins because she fed her husband to us and we whacked it what you didn't know that's what happened yeah that's what happened she uh was like yo i got this guy I gotta get rid of him. And she went to the tiger clan and we were like free food for no reason. Yummy. And then she was like, now I'm rich. And we were like, oh, wow, that's a crime. Oh, well, anywho. So um, back to you. Uh, do, do you have like, you said you don't have a girlfriend. Do you have any ex-girlfriends? Mm. Do you talk to them? No other worries. Just wondering, you know, if you talk to your exes or like if you're recently single and I'm going to have to go around and get rid of them. Uh, what? No, I'm just hungry. I'm just hungry. I'm just hungry. So uh, what's on the what's on the I can I, I don't mind wrestling up some food tonight. You know, maybe we could go to um, Applebee's and late night, you know, get some Burper Street steak and Oreo shake. What? Oh, it's a it's a song. No, anyways, country. It's cute. Um, so we're going to your place. Mm hmm Well, I mean, I just I thought I could help make it look a little bit better. You know? I don't know. Any anytime I go to uh someone's house and I leave my clothes on the floor, I, I like to say it's a nice decoration, isn't it? My my clothes on the floor. Oh, well, I was just hoping that you could help me point my shoes to Jesus. My shit, all my feet to my heels would be up towards Jace, to Jesus. To, it, well, that certainly is an interesting way to pray. But um, I was hoping, you know, I could I could help. Uh, you could help me. You could help me with my prayers and saying, uh, make help me be a real religious woman. Help me say, oh God, over and over and over. No, no just um, no, no. You're just you're one of those sweet innocent ones, which is nice, real nice. That means there's. Definitely a lot I can teach you. Mm -hmm. All right. So uh, where are we going? We're going back to your place. Yeah. This way? Oh, we're going to walk the entire way. <laughs> no, no, I have no problem with that. Though I was thinking maybe we could get on all fours and I could chase you a little bit because it really was fun going down the, the river, you know, stalking. I just, I haven't pounced on anybody in a long time. Uh, you know, pouncing? Well, what can I say? I'm a girl who likes to be on top of the world, if you know what I mean, you know? Exactly. Like, you could be Atlas. You could really lift me up. Mm-hmm. On your shoulder. No, no, no. I don't want to get on top of your shoulder. Well, I don't mind being on your shoulders, but I'd like to face the opposite way, if you know what I mean. No. no. It would make it very difficult for you to see where you're going. You're right. That is, that, that's, you know what, baby? Why don't you just, look, you start walking in the direction of your apartment. And uh, I'll just sit here babbling beside you because, God damn, you're so cute. You smell absolutely divine. <laughs> oh, sweet potato pot. What? Oh, yes, baby. That was me hitting on you this entire time. Don't worry. I'll explain all of those jokes to you in a good, good time. And I think I'll explain some of them over and over and over again. Hmm? <laughs> oh, no, don't worry. I'll explain that one as well. Because I like to, I, 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 don't worry, I'll be coming over and over and over again to your house. Oh, that's a bet I'm willing to take. <laughs> it 
can I get one more thing from you? Mm-hmm. Perfect. Hey guys, Zine Alexander here. So inspiration for this video, um, I'm really big into tigers. They're like one of my favorite uh, animals. And I, I would say if I had to identify, it would either be a bobcat or a tiger when it comes to like what type of animal I would be. And um, again, I'm very forward whenever I hit on people, but usually the people I hit on, it just, it, it doesn't, I tend to hit on very oblivious people. And also I tend to be very oblivious when you're hitting on me too. And there was a time that I saw this guy from far, far away. And I actually was a lifeguard at one point. And um, I thought he was so cute. And I thought he slipped and fell. And I ran over to him. And I'm sitting there trying to attend to him. I'm freaking out because I've been like, had this boy running, living rent free in my head for, for days because he kept showing up. And it ended up he didn't need any help whatsoever. He didn't slip and fall. He just sat down really quickly and then was behind, like, this partition thing. Um, so I was freaking out for no reason. But uh, it made it really easy to give him my phone number. Uh, we went on a couple of dates. Um, and then it was actually right around the time that we were graduating. So he went one way, I went another. I uh, don't actually know what happened with him. Sadness. So I thought it'd be fun to do an unhinged version of what happened because I did hit on him just as hard here. Uh, there will be there will be a uh, alternative version posted on Patreon later if you guys would like to go check that out. The link is in the pinned description below. Um, and then also getting ready for Fibbage this weekend. So if you guys want to get to know more about me and some other VAs, make sure that you join our Discord, which is in the link below. Um, super, super excited about that because I'd love to get to know more about other VAs that are out there. Um, I will also be doing a live stream of the Fibbage. So if you guys want to check that out and come hang out with us and learn about them, you're also welcome to do that. Anyways, um, I love you guys to death and I will see you in the next video. Bye.